What's going on my followers and this is me Frozen Cavern and today I have a pretty lengthy upload video but first off I want to say thank you all for us hitting 300 subscribers. Keep in mind I hit 200 subscribers about five months ago so in order to get two milestones within the same year that's a pretty amazing feat. Now I might be expecting a bit much by saying 400 but I want to say, let's try and get 350 by the end of the year. I think we can make that happen. I feel like it's possible at this point in time to possibly get 350 at the end of the year. But again, thank you all from the bottom of my heart. And as sappy as it sounds, yes, thank you all again for 300 subs. But anyways, enough about that. We're going to move on to the other things. Now, first off, let's plays. For those of you who don't know, I did just finish Kingdom Hearts 2, and that, is, <laughs> that has gone on for a long time. It's four months. Currently, all that's going on is Jack 3, which I'm hoping to have done by Tuesday. Now, at the time of this recording, I don't exactly have any full, complete idea on how long it's going to take until I beat the game, but I am hoping that I have the game beaten by Tuesday because after that I'm going to have Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday filled with the Kingdom Hearts Recoded movie if possible. I do need to get recordings on those as well and how that is going to work is that it's going to work the same way as a Kingdom Hearts Days movie worked where it's going to be three separate parts and it's going to be an hour each and I'm just going to commentate over particular sections. And then after that we're going to have Super Mario Odyssey hopefully on Saturday which is literally the day after it releases. And then for a little bit, it's just going to be Super Mario Odyssey. I feel like that's a good time to just get the Odyssey part settled in. And then once November 7th comes around, that's when Sonic Forces is going to be out. So probably the day after that, that's when Sonic Forces is going to have its own Let's Play. However, after that, it's a little... It's a little weird because there's not really any other like major releases after November that I'm really too keen on getting right now. But I'm wanting to assume that Sonic Forces will still be beaten in November since it is at the beginning of the month and Odyssey at the latest early December. It could easily change but eh, I, I don't really know. I'm wanting to hope for early December, mid-December at the latest. However, if either one of those games get beaten, I do have some options. One of them is that I could start Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance and that would like I said before, either be mid or early December. Another thing I could do is start up on No More Heroes because as with Kingdom Hearts 3, there's going to be a new No More Heroes title in 2018, which of course I have to prepare for both of those, hopefully. So hopefully I can get one of those started then, and if that doesn't happen, then the other game will probably be started up in January. And something else that I kind of want to do, and it's going to be really risky to try and do, but I do want to go back to some other Let's Plays that I haven't exactly finished, like Psychonauts, because for those of you who don't know, I did start a Psychonauts playthrough back in the summer this year. Problem is, I didn't get around to finishing it because I was doing something at the time, so I decided, hey, let's just record all of Sly and then do some of Kingdom Hearts 2 recording and did nothing for Psychonauts, so yeah, that one kind of flew out of the dust, but I want to see if I can bring that back. And then there's also Ocarina of Time, which happened at the beginning of this year, but I ended up rage quitting and I never actually told anyone on the actual channel. So yeah, let's see if we can try and bring either of those back. I know that both of those games are going to take a good amount of time because Ocarina of Time is like a pretty long game. And then Psychonauts, I was at the beginning of the game, so that's going to have some decent link to that, but only possibly? It's, it's going to be rather sketchy trying to fit those in somewhere. But for the most part, that's really what's going to happen for the rest of the year in terms of Let's Plays. In terms of 2018, Kingdom Hearts 3, obviously that's going to happen. No More Heroes. I don't have any idea when that's going to release, all I know is that it's 2018, similar to how Kingdom Hearts 3 is, but like I said before, I want to get the No More Hero series in, like, in and done before, you know, the next installment. And then I'm probably going to save Sly 4 until next year, because trying to fit it into, like, this year 
it's not going to work out all that well. Even though I didn't want to try and finish Sly 4, well, the entire Sly series this year, so I could move on to other series, but that's unfortunately not exactly going to happen. But hey, it might work out for the better because last year I had Sly 1, this year I have 2 and 3, and then next year I'll have 4, so eh, it might work out a little bit. Alright, so now that that is out of the way, now we get to social medias. As some of you might already know, I do have a Twitter and I don't really leave it in the description ever. So I need to kind of start doing that. So in the description of this video, I'm going to have a link to my Twitter. That way you guys can know anything about current updates on like what video games I'm going to be playing for the channel, any videos I've uploaded, basically stuff like that that a lot of other YouTubers do. And then I also have a Discord server, which honestly I do kind of want to start using because whenever I'm using a Discord server, I'm using someone else's. <laughs> That's pretty much what happens when it comes to all the live streams and junk. That's unfortunately like really the only thing that I ever actually do. Therefore, if I make my own Discord server, then I can have my own community in there and then we'll all be talking to each other and you guys can get to know me a little bit better. And I'll try to have a link in the description for that as well. Now, speaking of live streams, what I have planned next for live streams is basically I'm going to be doing Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep to try and get the Platinum Trophy for that. Because recently I did manage to get the Kingdom Hearts 1 Platinum Trophy in like the last live stream at the time of this recording. So that's three of the four games on 1.5 plus 2.5, so that's really really good. But Birth by Sleep, I have never actually 100%ed like everything in Birth by Sleep. So that will be a fun, fun journey, except uh, it's also going to be a little bit stressful on that, but we're not going to worry too much about that. But aside from that, that is everything that is going to be in this update. So once again, I want to thank you all for 300 subscribers. Let's try to get to 350 by the end of the year. If we get to 400, that would be an amazing, amazing feat. But I'm just going to keep my expectations a little low. That might be a little bit down on myself, for lack of a better word right now. But I'm just trying to be a little bit reasonable. But until next video, take care.